here we are today bringing you some old Hungary Magyar stamps. Look at that. We got one great big huge group right here. Starting with you have your five in a brown and white. You have your ten in a burgundy and white, but it's not really white, it's more like a cream color. Then you have a 15 in a black and white. And then a 20 in a deeper brown and white. Then you go down to the second row. And there you have where it used to be 60. And it was turned into 25. In the brown and white. And then you have a 60 that did not get turned into a 25. Okay, and then you have a 100 that's in red. Look at that. The wording's in red. And that's on a brown and white. And then you have your burgundy. That's a 100, but in black. The writing's in black while the other one was in red. So that's kind of neat. Same value, but different color and different color writing. So that's kind of cool. Then they ventured off into different colors. Then they went into blue and white for 250. Okay, and then you have your orange and white. That's in red for 500. Let's see, February of 76. Wow. That's really cool. And then you have 1,000 in a brown and white. That 76 is 1876, I believe. Okay, now let's go visit some more Magyar stamps from Hungary. Here's our next group. Now look at that top one. Isn't that neat? Now the whole thing about that top stamp, if it did not have that red flag and the date on it, it'd be worth a lot. Of course, I don't have the big winner one. I have the one that has a date on it. I went through all my stamps, one by one, looking to see if I could find the one that was the big win. Did not find it. That's always fun to try. Okay, and then in the second row, you have a 1. Now that's pretty cool, too, to turn around and see the bird like that fly in. Some of the other stamps that have the bird are valuable. But first, you have your 1 in a black and white. You have your 3 in orange and white. You have your 5 in a beautiful green. I love that shade of green. Not a light green, just a nice minty green. Okay, and then you have your six, which is kind of, hmm, can't say gray, can't say olive green, more olive green than anything. Okay. See, there's your six right there, really good. But look for that top stamp. See if there's no date and no red flag on it. If you find one of them, by all means, get it graded and get it to an auction and get yourself rich. <laughs> all right, now here we go to our last group of the good old stamps from Magyar. And here we have, they're all the same design, just different amounts. You have your 10. You have your 40, you have 50, 
you have 120, and you got 200. All right. Hope you've enjoyed my bringing them to you. Be sure to sub me, join me as a friend, and by all means, share the video. I'd appreciate that. Thank you. Bye-bye.